The move from Ankara comes ahead of a Libya peace summit scheduled for this Sunday in Berlin. Turkey's president is also due to address the conflict with his counterparts from Germany, Russia, Britain and Italy. For more on this story, here's a correspondent Jasper Mortimer reporting from Ankara. Erdogan said today here in Ankara that Turkey is beginning to send troops. But he didn't say anything about how many troops were involved or how armed those troops would be. So we don't know if they'll be supported by tanks, helicopters, planes or anything like that. Last week, Erdogan said that Turkey had already sent military personnel to Libya. And Foreign Minister Mevlut Cavusoglu clarified that these were specialists, uh, military advisors to help the Tripoli government. And one figure in the press said that they were no more than 35 of them. Now, his words today uh, do not give an indication of how much further Turkey's deployment to Libya has progressed. But one should note that both uh, America and the European Union have urged Turkey not to uh, intervene in Libya. However, Turkey was uh, angered by the collapse of the uh, peace talks in Moscow on the weekend. It blamed uh, the rebel general Khalifa Haftar for walking away from the peace table in Moscow uh, and said this showed that he was only interested in a military solution. And um, earlier this week, um, Erdogan said, uh, you know, if Haftar doesn't get serious about peace, we will teach him a lesson that he deserves. And one wondered what Turkey had the resources to teach that lesson with. 